Hey everyone, so I just wanted to make another video today and that is about binging in your recovery. So I just ate my dinner and then after dinner I realized like I wasn't full and I wanted some dates. So I went and I got my thing of dates out of the fridge and I was thinking like, oh I don't need this to meet my calorie minimum. Should I eat more? Like, should I eat it? And that was the eating disorder side of my brain talking and the eating disorder part of my mind saying, like, you already ate your minimum, don't eat any more. But the other part of my mind was saying, you want these dates, you don't feel full enough, obviously, if you're craving them, so eat the dates. So what did I do? I ate the dates. And let me tell you, I ate nearly the entire thing of dates and my calories for today, my the minimum I was supposed to meet, I nearly doubled. So what I was thinking when I did that was they're just dates. Like, it's a healthy food first off. So why am I feeling bad about it? And second off, I realized I was still, like I wasn't overstuffed. I was craving them and that's, I think that's a big part of recovery is overcoming like your fears and the eating disorder side of my brain considered purging considered just like go out and exercise it just it's controlling and my nutritionist recommended this book to me it's called life without ed and it's basically about how your eating disorder is the other side of your brain and how your eating disorder talks to you it tells you to do these things and you have to learn to sorry and you have to learn to control it so i just wanted to make this video to document that if you're recovering and you have a binge don't feel bad about it you need these calories i need all the calories i just ate it's not gonna kill me it's only gonna bring me closer to my recovery and I realized that, and I don't feel guilty at all. I ate those dates until I was sick of them, and I'll probably have more tomorrow when I want them again. But try to not let the eating disorder side of your brain control you. And you know, I'm recovering myself. I know it's hard. I know some meals I sit down and I don't even want to eat anything. And then I know there's or the eating disorder side of my brain says that. You know, like, it's just very controlling and you have to control it. And learning to control it is a part of recovery because that part of your brain and your eating disorder, as it, I'm acting as if it was a person, just wants to control you and maintain the control. And you just have to control yourself. I said, I'm eating the, I didn't really say it out loud, but I thought I'm eating these dates because I want to eat these dates because I'm craving it, like just because I can and I didn't let my eating disorder control that. So don't think you're binging when you're recovering because there is no binging. You need all the calories you can get right now. Your body is telling you and screaming at you that it needs calories. And that's what my body was doing. So I ate those calories. And I don't feel guilty about it. But thank you guys for watching. And I don't know what I was just about to say. But if you want any support or need support or just anything, you can message me on Instagram or Snapchat or something. And I will have that on the screen and linked down below. So thank you so much for watching. And sorry for my dog, but that's it. So just real quick video. So thank you for watching. Bye.